Hello and welcome to my final video of 2023, which is hard to believe. How did we get here? I swear it was just Christmas 2022 and suddenly it's almost 2024. I can't believe it. That was a lot of numbers I just said all in one go. Anyways. Merry Christmas. I hope you all had a wonderful holiday season, whether you celebrate Christmas or not. I hope you've just had a relaxing, nice time filled with yummy food, drinks, family and friends. That's basically how we have spent our time. We had such a wonderful Christmas. I feel like every year I'm like, this was the best Christmas ever. Like it was just, wasn't this great? Oh, it was lovely. Relaxing, so lovely. fun. We're here in Palm Springs. Uh, here's the house tour if you want to see how cute and aesthetic this Airbnb is that we rented. And it is six of us. It is myself, my boyfriend, my mom, my dad, my brother and his wife. And my brother and his wife live in France, so we don't get to see them very often. And they came for a whole two weeks, which was like the best Christmas gift ever, honestly. And they also both asked me to help them curate a skincare routine from the French pharmacy. And that truly felt like a Christmas gift. I cannot wait to curate them the perfect French pharmacy skincare routine. Anyways, without further ado, let's get into the classic what I got for Christmas video. I feel honestly like extremely spoiled this year. I feel very grateful. I got so many beautiful gifts from so many beautiful people in my life. So here is this adorable stocking, which we brought with us. We brought all the Christmas decor from my LA place to this Palm Springs place and it fit the vibe perfectly. And I actually got quite a few things on my Christmas wish list that I shared in this video which I was not expecting. So that was very exciting. First off in the stocking, I have this Blissy silk pillowcase, which is great for skin and hair, and it's just a white color. And I'm excited to try this. I have never used this brand before, but I've heard really great things. I believe it's an LA-based brand, and um, they're much more affordable than the Slip brand, which is like one of my favorite silk companies. Check out Blissy if you're also in the market for a silk pillowcase. I think they sell it on Amazon and stuff too, which is nice. Socks, I feel like that's a stocking must have. These are the Free People Ruffled Ankle Socks. I am obsessed with my Free People Ruffle Sport Socks, so I'm excited to give this different style a try. Very similar, it's just like a slightly lower profile, but they're the most comfortable socks. And then they have a cute ruffle, and I just got black and white because I pretty much wear black and white socks exclusively. And then chocolate from what has become my absolute new favorite chocolate company. Um, all four of us kids, which is so funny to say because I'm the youngest and I'm almost 30, um, but all four of us got Tony's chocolate. If you ever come across this, it's amazing. My brother and his wife used to live in London and they said they actually used to get it in London too. So I don't know what flavor did I get, Mom? This one is almond sea salt dark chocolate. I have not tried this flavor yet. It's so hefty. This stuff is rich. It is luxurious. Highly recommend. Also from my Christmas wish list, I got an electric lighter, which I have not tried yet. It is, for me filming this, it's Boxing Day, which in case you don't know what that is, it's just the day after Christmas, uh, the 26th. So I have not tried it yet, but it is an electric lighter. What color is it? Gold? Yep, gold. And like a deep gold. And then like this part bends, which is nice. And okay, I'll turn it on. Ooh. Very fun. So it's like a lighter that you recharge and I light candles all the time with a long lighter and uh, this will be fun. I'm excited to try this. And then the final thing in the stocking is this. I don't know, does it go this way? Yep. It is a chocolate orange, a classic Christmas stocking stuffer that must be at the bottom of every stocking from the time I was wee. Next up, speaking of my brother and his wife, other than requesting I help them with a skincare routine, they got me these adorable slippers, which are just so me. Um, I believe the brand is actually an Irish company, but they found it at a little boutique in the south of France where they live. And they are giving me free people, which is very my aesthetic. They are multicolored, right? Yeah. There's um, purple, green. And a lovely brown, beautiful brown, bronzy brown purple, green, and brown, and they're like, um, they're made of wool, and they're like little sheep's hooves, and they're the perfect size for me, and I wear slippers every day, all day when I'm at home, so I don't stub my toes, because you know, being a blind girl, it's not easy, and I don't walk in any dog slobber. Very handy and useful to me. 
Oh, and if you've watched any of my previous What I Got For Christmas videos, you know that in my family on Christmas Eve, we all open a new pair of pajamas and then you wear it that night and you have new Christmas PJs. And this year I provided the PJs for the fam and we all got matching ones. You might have seen it if you watched this video where I shared gifts that I was giving this year. And these are them. So that is what I am wearing. They're very much giving Christmas in Palm Springs energy. They're white with red trim. They're from Bedhead which just make the most beautiful patterns, such high quality PJs. And I'm gonna insert some B-roll here of Elton wearing his matching ones. The whole fam was so cute. Maybe I'll put some pictures of all of us. And yeah, there's like palm trees and Christmas trees and Santa at the beach uh, and so many other cute, very like beachy Santa vibes. You guys, look at Elton. This is his, um, one of his toys, it's Santa. This was also in the, actually, this was in the gift that my, boyfriend got me that you'll see later in this video but I had to show you him and his what matching the whole fam come on now adorable with your Santa and I, I kept we kept joking that we all looked like a Christmas cult <laughs> and we called ourselves the servants of Saint Nicholas <laughs> I like to think our cult documentary on Netflix would be called like the Christmas cult colon servants of Saint Nicholas <laughs> next up from my adorable guy doggy Elton <laughs> I cannot, I'm dying over this. It truly is the little things, you guys. This is a poop bag dispenser. It comes with a roll of poop bags. I don't know where he found this, but bravo to him. Good find, Elton. It is silicone, like uh, with a clip on top. So you can attach it to your leash or your belt loop or wherever. And it's a silicone avocado dispenser. <gasps> I'm obsessed. It's so freaking adorable, so. And I mean, it's a little bit self-serving. By the way, I think Elton had more fun at Christmas than anybody. Like he brought the Christmas joy. You know how like Christmas feels so much more festive when you have like a little kid in the house? Elton was the little kid in the house, wasn't he mom? Yes, he was awesome. He got so many toys and he was so excited. It was adorable. Um, next up, I love Moomin. Uh, I did not grow up reading or watching Moomin, um, but one of my patrons, Maja Lind, introduced me to Moomin a few years back when she sent me some Moomin mugs and I just fell in love with the aesthetic and the characters and I've been collecting Moomin things ever since. So I got a few new things to add to my collection and it's so funny because the day before Christmas, I was sitting on this couch thinking about how I need to pick up some more Moomin stuff for my collection. <laughs> so my loved ones know me well. This is just a little dish and it's like the shape of Moomin, and then it has um, engraving inside, and I like it because it's just all white, so it's very clean looking, and I think it'll look really cute in my BC place. Um, just on my bedside table, like a little dish to put things in. Um, if I'm like already in bed and I wanna take my rings off or something, that is perfect. And then I got not one, but two Moomin tea light holders. So tea lights are like those little candles, um, and I'm gonna leave one in LA and I'm gonna leave one in BC. Uh, one of them is like a pastel pink and that's the one I'm gonna have in LA. And then the other one is like a burnt orange color, which will look perfect on my dining table in BC. And they are so cute. So the pink one is putting on a necklace and doing her makeup. <laughs> so me. And then the orange one is tending to the roses, which is very my mom. I'm going to share what my boyfriend got me last because it's so fun and cute. So next up, I will show you what Santa Claus got me. This I was really not expecting to get, so I was very excited and surprised to open it. It's another thing from my wish list, which is the Vintage Relux, Relux Vintage Prada necklace. So this is not a Prada necklace. This is a necklace that is made using a vintage Prada piece. So. This is the black and silver triangle Prada logo. And this is from a vintage Prada piece. And then they remove it from the purse or clothing item or shoe and they add a chain to it. So it'll go with my Prada bag and loafers that I wear all the time because they have the same logo and they're also black and silver, but it is not quite as expensive as actually buying it like from Prada and I love the chunky silver chain. Really, I was really shocked to receive that. So very appreciative. I did not expect that. And the other thing I was very excited about, which was from my parents and it was a very big gift. So I'm very grateful. And it is Christmas slash my 30th, which is gonna be in February. 
Um, and it is this scary little contraption. Um, this is an LED therapy light mask. It has red light, infrared light, and blue light. And it is the TheraBody one, which is the one that I wanted after much research and consideration. Uh, it's a hard shell one. Uh, it has built-in goggles for eye safety. It has this head strap, which makes it very comfortable and evenly disperses the weight around your head. And it also vibrates, giving you a head and face massage. You use it for nine minutes a day, every single day. It automatically shuts off when the nine minutes are up. And it is supposed to help with um, anti-aging as well as anti-acne. So very pleased about that. And it comes with this little stand. So I will have my creepy little mask sitting in its stand upright. I'll have to figure out where I'm gonna keep it, my bathroom maybe or something. So I already used it last night and I have my brother's wife use it and I'm gonna have my mom try it. I cannot wait. I will be doing that every single day. I didn't bring gifts that I received prior to Christmas day with me to show you, but my boyfriend's family gave me some really lovely gifts, including his mom making homemade Taylor Swift style friendship bracelets with all of my guide dog's names on them, which was just one of the most thoughtful things ever. Um, as well as a sweater, some toys for Elton and Lavender. Uh, and his sister gave me like some nice scented hand lotions and soaps and a bag with my name embroidered on it. And then his brother and I both love Japan and he got me a beautiful special glass for drinking sake, which I enjoy drinking with sushi. So that was really lovely. And I got a Harry and David gift basket from uh, one of my team members, which we have been eating. Okay, here are a few goodies. We've been enjoying all of it here in Palm Springs. It had the chocolate covered almonds, some chocolate chip cookies, crackers, cheese. It was a mix of savory and sweet, which I really appreciated. And it of course had the iconic Harriet and David pears, which I greatly enjoyed. And this mustard. And if we can find the mustard in the fridge, I'm gonna insert some B-roll because I need to find that mustard and buy it. Elton, what are you doing here? Jesus Lord. <laughs> And finally, the gift from my boyfriend. This is our first Christmas together, and he made me, he did so well. He made me a burr basket. If you aren't on like TikTok and Instagram and stuff, you might not know what this is, but basically it was this thing that boyfriends were doing. In October, it was a boo basket, and then in December, it was a burr basket, which is essentially just like a gift basket. Um, so it's this little basket that says Merry and Bright, I think, right? Merry and Bright? Is that what it says? Yes. He put like these sparkly um, textured ribbons on everything and stuff, it's so cute. He got me this card on Etsy, which is super tactile and it's shiny. And then inside it's shiny with braille, a little sweet braille message. And then he got a little voice recorder and he recorded a poem, he writes poetry. So he recorded a little poem for me. I know, it's so sweet. sweet. And he got me this, which is a kit so that we can make a cast of Elton's paw to hang on the Christmas tree. So we'll do this together as a little DIY. He wanted to do it himself, like pre-make the cast and then give me the ornament of Elton's paw. But he's like, you and Elton are together 24 seven. Like I can't get Elton away from you long enough. I don't know where he got it. He said he got it somewhere online. He got me this mushroom matcha. Um, I really love matcha. I got him really into matcha. He also really loves mushrooms, like the power of all, you know, lion's mane and all the different mushrooms. So he found this online and it is a matcha with mushrooms. So it combines both. And there's a ton of mushrooms in there. Do you want to read them? And it came with a little recipe book um, for different like foods and drinks you can make with it, as well as a matcha scooping spoon. Cordyceps for stamina, lion's mane for focus, reishi? Reishi. For stress relief, shiitake for immune support, turkey tail for healthy digestion, and king trumpet for anti-inflammation. There you go. Matcha, natural energy, fat burning, calm focus, antioxidant. Amazing. Yeah, so yeah. very excited for that. And then speaking of mushrooms, he got me these cookies. Um, they're from Erewhon. I'm not sure if anywhere else sells them. I tried them for the first time in this Erewhon taste test video that I did, and they are reishi cookies. So it's a mushroom cookie. It does not taste like mushroom. Um, and they are like a gluten-free, healthy cookie, and they're so, so yummy. So I will definitely be enjoying those. And then from Trader Joe's, he picked me up some soaps. There is a lavender scented soap bar and a peppermint shampoo bar. 
he basically wanted to get me like different things from categories in my life that I love, which is very cute. He got me Braille Uno, which I used to have, but I've moved so many times as we all know, and I haven't been able to find them. So he picked these up for me and it's perfect because we were already playing our first game as a family and my brother won, but that's okay because this time, Today, today is my game. I will win. Very excited to have Braille Uno and it's inspired me. I had so much fun playing. It's inspired me to want to pick up more Braille games. He also got me a bunch of my favorite, one of my favorite fidget toys. They're oh, like, they make a great noise. Tell too. me that's not the most satisfying sound. It's funny because when um, I was opening everything, uh, he was playing with one. My brother's wife was playing with one. I was playing with one. Fun for the whole fam. And then in here, I was so obsessed with like how he, he just got this box to wrap it with, but I'm like, no, the box itself is a gift. It's so cute. It's a bunch of dogs dressed up for Christmas and then has a fluffy pom-pom on top. And inside is this really beautiful ornament for me to hang somewhere in my Love home. And it's gold with a bunch of multicolored rainbow crystals. And you hang it in the light and the light catches all the crystals and shines a rainbow, which is so me. Isn't it pretty, Mom? It's gorgeous, I love it, it's beautiful. In the sun, I'm telling you guys, it's mesmerizing. Then he got me pepper spray. This is a bright pink keychain pepper spray. Um, and he very much cares about my safety, which I appreciate. We were like talking a few weeks ago, you know, I live in LA, uh, it's a big city, and I, I don't live in the suburbs of LA. I live in LA proper, and it's a big city, and there's lots of crime, as there is in big cities, and being like a petite blind girl, it's sometimes scary going out. Um, so yeah, for my safety, he picked me up this neon pink keychain pepper spray, which scares me to have a little bit, but it is very safely secure and he will teach me how to properly and safely use it if I am ever in an emergency situation. I, you know, growing up in Canada, like, it's illegal, we can't have it, but here in California, it is legal to carry. So, now I have it. Then he got me the Clinique uh, Black Honey Lipstick, the Iconic. I was like, how did you even know about this? And he was like, I was looking at lists, because like I said, he tried to make sure it's like, there's something from every like category of my life that encaptures who I am as a person. And I love makeup and I'm always applying lip stuff. So he got me the Clinique Black Honey and he's a big nerd as I've shared with you guys. And when he was reading one of the lists of, of lip recommendations, it had said that this was the lipstick that one of the characters, female characters was wearing in like Lord of the Rings or something one of those movies. And so that's why he specifically picked this as well as the fact that it's supposed to work on every skin tone. So I already put it on and I really like it. And it's such an iconic product and I've never owned it. So I feel like it, it was about time that I own it. And then the last thing in the burr basket was also from my Christmas wish list, which are these products from 4AM Skin. Now I only wanted the eye patches, which come in this little tin and they are reusable silicone eye patches. So they go under your eyes and frankly, I can never justify buying the under eye patches for myself because I feel like it's really wasteful and it's so expensive to like buy these one use eye patches. Same reason I don't buy myself sheet masks. I just feel like it's wasteful when I could just get a tube or a jar of a face mask that I can reuse over and over again. And so I heard about these on TikTok in a gift guide and I was like, those sound great. And they're $16 for like unlimited use. And basically they're just silicone and they have all these cute phrases written on them. And then the um, trick is that, you know, usually eye masks come soaked in serum, but you just put your own serum or eye cream on and then stick them under for 10 to 20 minutes. And uh, he actually got me the serum that goes with it. So I didn't know that they made skincare products, but I guess it makes sense. So he bought me the serum to use as well. You can just use any serum or any eye cream, which is what I planned to do, but he treated me to the serum that goes with it, which was really sweet. So that is everything that I got for Christmas this year. And I feel so lucky and so blessed. I'm very excited to use my eye patches tonight for the first time. And then I'll put my face mask on 
and uh, yeah, this was such an amazing Christmas. I feel so grateful for every single thing that I received. Thank you so much to all of you for being in my life, for watching this video, for watching other videos that I post, for engaging with my content. It means so much to me and that's the best gift that you as my viewers can give me is your support and your love in the comments. Um, so thank you for always doing that. I am looking forward to everything that's to come in 2024, which is a mystery to me still. We'll see what's to come. And I hope you're all going to be there along with me for the ride. And until then, you can click over here if you want to see a non-festive video. If you would like to see me playing a blind-friendly racing game, like a video game designed for the blind, check that out. I just posted it a few weeks ago. Super fun video. Or you can click over here to see this adorable house tour where we've spent the holidays. All right. Love you guys. Bye. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Love you.